Hi everyone, my name is Jorge, welcome to my channel and today we'll be doing a review on AlgoExpert.io We're going to be talking about this platform and uh, basically this is a platform that uh, it will help you prepare for coding interviews Alright, so let's get started with it Okay, so I'm going to show you how it looks like. So this is the website of Algo Expert. Uh, it's basically a website that has two products, right? And uh, I'm going to be reviewing mostly just Algo Expert, which is the one I got for myself uh, last year when I uh, was going into an interview uh, <laughs> sprint, basically, with a few companies. And uh, they also have a uh, systems expert uh, product, which uh, will help you for uh, design interviews, which is a different kind of interview that you might get if you are uh, interviewing for uh, uh, like a higher level when system design is required, right? But uh, in general, like I'll, I'll go expert will focus only on the problems that you'll typically see in uh, coding interviews. And uh, you can see that the website actually has a, a, a content page where you'll find your database on 90 questions and uh, they are uh, organized by uh, difficulty or or category and uh, they also have some some free questions so how it looks like and this is like uh, what they have for free and uh, you can just open up one of these um, uh, exercises and it will showcase the problem you can uh, write your code they also have like uh, tests you can have like custom tests written by you so that you can test what you're doing and uh, one of the things that I actually like the most is, th is that they have video explanations for everyone and each of these problems they will explain through a video um, how the problem uh, looks like how would you solve it uh, sometimes they explore like multiple solutions. It's not on just one na naive solution. They actually explore a naive solution and then a more complex, more optimal solution within these explanations. And they do it uh, in a very abstract way, like uh, not directly jumping into the code, but they also like explain uh, just by using drawings. And, uh, and basically this helps... Uh, uh, us as you know like people who are studying and practicing to understand how the problem can be solved and that's uh, basically what I consider to be the big selling selling point on algo expert now uh, to talk a little bit more about this platform um, I'd say that uh, there's a lot of things I liked and uh, very few that I, I, I could say that I didn't like uh, but mostly I think that uh, you can use this to understand not only the problems that you'll find in this website, but let's say for me, for example, one thing uh, that I recommend if you are like going into an interviewing spree to get a job in a big tech company or something like that, I, I would recommend to always diversify your resources. You want to uh, probably get a book, you want to probably try a few platforms, like more than one platform, you might uh, wanna like get some real in-person mock interviews with uh, people you know, with software engineers that could give you feedback and all that kind of things. Like every, everything helps, like all that kinds of uh, resources definitely helps. Now, why I think that uh, Algo Expert ex stands out is because the video explanations, what you learn there, and when you understand how to solve problems, that knowledge, what that those learnings, you can transfer that knowledge to these other platforms or resources. And when I say other platforms or resources, let's say that you are using another uh, popular website for uh, coding, you know, uh, competitions and uh, you know uh, solving problems and everything. You can use this knowledge to actually uh, get better at those other websites. And that's what I really like about this platform is that you can transfer these learnings and apply them to those, you know, sites. And that means that this is the other thing I want to mention is that you can use these learnings to actually do well in your interviews, even if they are like mock interviews, like in-person real interviews, phone interviews, like 
because the problems in essence they are the same so I really think that this helped me out now for me I was using two different websites and I was using a book and I was also using in-person mock interviews with people that I actually know in real life now I use all of this together to get prepared for going and interviewing with some companies and now um, if you need a little bit of credibility yeah I did interview with uh, Google Facebook uh, Microsoft Dropbox and uh, a couple more companies but uh, the main ones were were these four um, that I say were like the biggest like challenging uh, companies to get into and I did manage to get a, a couple of offers and um, for me what this means is that yes this platform definitely works now that being said if I were to say something uh, that could be improved or you know like a, an uh, area of opportunity for this platform uh, I wouldn't really know whether that if they had a bigger database that would add more value into the platform but I think this is enough and uh, but it is enough in this way that I will try to explain right now don't rely solely on one single resource if you are preparing and your target is to get into one of these companies that would definitely be a big challenge uh, I, I would say that you have to diversify and use multiple resources in order to prepare because that would change uh, that would keep you safe from falling into a comfort zone if you get really comfortable at just one platform then that might affect you negatively when you actually go to interview with, with, with a company right so I would recommend uh, two things uh, first one don't interview just at one company you have to have options you have to uh, interview a lot if you want to get good because this is something that you improve by practice and if you can also access like multiple resources like not just algo expert but other resources uh, whatever resources that you can find try to uh, use at least four or five different resources that so that you never fall into that comfort zone and uh, with that also you know like on the plate I'd say that yes I'll go expert I think it's worth it um, during my preparation I only purchased like two different products two different platforms online I purchased a, a book and I uh, also use free resources as well as asking help from friends and colleagues to do like a in-person mock interviews and all that now i use all of that but what i really like about algo expert is that many of the explanations that i found there like actually helped me in all those other things like it, the, the, these explanations helped me to solve problems in other platforms they helped me to solve problems in real interviews with these companies and in the end I got a couple of offers and I would say that uh, given that history and uh, uh, having also another thing is that at the time I was uh, I started like preparing I already had a little bit of experience with uh, with coding interviews at the time I, I was actually working for Amazon right that's the reason why I didn't interview with Amazon but um, I already knew what kind of what I was expecting so I'd say that yes with that in mind definitely this is a good platform I would definitely recommend you to try it out and uh, hey it's just like $85 I mean if you could get a really high uh, wage job you in a well-known company all the prestige that you're gonna get if you if you if you get the job then yeah $85 is definitely worth your time like I, I say do it you, you can definitely go spend this money and if you actually are disciplined and you practice then that's how you're gonna get the most out of this platform now don't just go and buy it and don't do anything later because that won't wouldn't help anyone if you buy it and then you use it and you go and use this knowledge and apply it to all the resources that you have then yes I think that you can get a job and uh, you know like big tech company or it would definitely pass the coding interviews definitely so that's what i have to say i hope you guys like this video and i'll see you next time bye bye